yo what's going on guys welcome back to the channel man it's your boy real quick video for you guys while i'm talking about gear i completely forgot to show you guys an event that's going on right now that you definitely want to take advantage of and it's actually this equivalent exchange event for pendants so we already know that if you want ssr pendants you can trade sr pendants for them but that's not a really good trade for me personally right because there's way more sr characters that i want to build up i want to complete my box however what you want to do is actually trade your rare pendant you can see i have almost 900 pretty close to a thousand they're taking up inventory space but you never want to sell them speaking of inventory space i know some of you guys are going to ask me is it worth it to increase your inventory space in this game yes it is because the more stuff you can hold the better personally right you can keep a lot of gear and a lot of stuff in your inventory for special events and then you can compress them later on so for me having a lot of inventory space over 400 is all i need i don't need to go all the way up to 500 so just keep that in mind if i don't need 500 you don't either around 400 is a good place to be you don't need to hoard stuff per se but you need to get a good amount of stuff in your inventory so that you have what you need when you need it however it's a lot of pendants i don't need this why because we don't get rare characters that often we actually haven't gotten any new rare characters since the game launched right and there's only a couple of them that are still worth building in my opinion people like marmus still worth building people like twigo still worth building people like alione still worth building but a lot of them not worth building and we don't know when this event is coming back so i would definitely recommend that if you have 200 rare pendants to sit in there i would say go here click on the pendant click on the rare pendant and then go to equivalent exchange and then turn those pendants into anvils right so you can see right here we can turn 200 of these rare pendants into 200 anvils this is an amazing trade i would rather shit if i could i would have traded all of them every single one of them for anvils however unfortunately it's limited <laughs> to only 200 so i'm gonna have to wait until the next time and here's the thing every time you run fort Sogris, you're gonna get more rear pendants so don't miss out on this opportunity right this is literally the only conversion in here that's worth it to me the limit break material thing i've never used it trading my hammers for um purple stones i would never do that personally right but the rear pendants for anvils that's a really 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 good look okay also i seen one of you guys asking me yo how do you change your outfit for meliodas come here this one my bad <laughs> anyways i could if i want to i can just come here and i can change meliodas and give him some new drip okay just like that to my guy look at my guy looking swap about to pull up on you just know you, be, you better be lucky man you better be lucky. look look at my guy bro look at my guy looking sharp looking 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 fly bro <laughs> anyways also something really cool that i should i should show you guys while i'm at it okay lots of tips for you guys here all right come here talk to elizabeth every single day it's gonna put you in gyro mode you can only do this on your phone you cannot do this on a computer so go on your phone right it's gonna allow you to look around the tavern and now what you can do is you can just like uh hold on hold on hold on Mm, yeah, yeah you see you see you can you can simp a little bit you can simp a little bit mm -hmm, yeah yeah look at you you looking cute anyways <laughs> anyways um the, the real thing that i want to show you is you can go upstairs in the tavern boys now you might you might be saying why the hell would i care what's upstairs don't worry i got you bro i got you bro right i'm here for the tips bro i'm here for the tips and the tricks let's go you know i love the tricks <laughs> They say tricks are for kids. But anyways, man. Oh, by the way, painting on the wall. You can inspect that. What's that going to do for you? Don't worry. A little bit of change. You see? 500 gold. That's not that much, right? That's cool, partner. That's fine. That's not what we're here for. That's just icing on the cake. Check this out. <laughs> Check this out. So basically, you go up to the second floor. And then you look underneath um, Hellbroom's helmet. And it's going to give you a free PvP ticket. Grand Cross is all about PvP, right? A free PvP ticket is one hour. Just keep that in mind. There's some people who've been playing since launch and they've never come up here. They're probably like, what the heck is this blasphemy? What is this? This is a free PvP ticket that allows you to participate in the fight festival. And you can get this once every day after reset. So come up here every single day. King is literally just showing you where it's at, right? And then you can get a free PvP ticket. Then you can go into PvP. And uh, if you win using coin food, 
hey man that's 300 coins free just like that anyways man i'm gonna catch you guys in the next one hopefully this video was informative till next time be safe i'm gonna go back and change my change my outfit a little bit you know let's go here boom coat hanger beast mode let's get it uh let's go let's go with this one there we go my guy looking sharp he looking battle tested he looking like you pull up i'm gonna flex on you all right cool also bitch make sure you get your vanya ale every day because that's what you use oh yeah i guess while i'm here i should talk about some other things too eh? um <laughs> see you can get free weapons and cosmetics which are free outfits for your characters by feeding them the food that they like and um like like for example her right she likes these little food thing here so you can go cook it in the thing or you can give her like vanya ale and you can get free diamonds and extra outfits for them right so just a little tim bit there i figured i'll go ahead and show you guys real quickly hopefully the video was helpful though till next time be safe guys and I'm gone. Peace.